to the longest running quiz show in the area. Category. High school students compete to answer questions on topics from art to science, history to current events. And now, here's your category's host, John Bartell. Hi, welcome to Categories, and today we're bringing you a contest with teams from the furthest reaches of our, of our competitive area. We have the Blue Valley West Jaguars versus the Shawnee Mission North Indians. Let's go ahead and meet our competitors first from Blue Valley West, Stephen. Hi, I'm Stephen Rong, and I'm a senior. I'm Gib Baltzer, and I'm also a senior. I'm Peter Bushman, and I'm a sophomore. Walker Womack, and I'm a sophomore. Kevin Protzman, senior. And our competitors from Shawnee Mission North, Kalen. I'm Kalen Peterson, and I'm a senior. I'm Sam Maher, and I'm a senior. I'm Adam Moon, and I'm a sophomore. I'm Lizzie Braden, and I'm a senior. I'm Bethany Harris, and I'm a senior. Fantastic. Here on categories, the first round is a round that the question is asked of one team. If they choose uh, or if they answer incorrectly, the other team will have a chance to steal. We did a coin toss before the taping started, and it was won by Shawnee Mission North. So North, here is the first category. It is language, specifically in regards to computers. In 1982, computer scientist Scott Fallman invented an entire class of symbols when he typed three punctuation marks in a message. The smiley is an example of what class of symbols? Sam. Emoticons. Emoticons is exactly right. West, your category is chemistry. Diffusion is a chemical process whereby particles move from a region of higher concentration to a region of lower concentration. The diffusion which takes place through a semi-permeable membrane of a living cell is called what? Peter. Osmosis. Osmosis is correct. Indians, geography is the next category. What 3,450 mile long river rises in the Tibetan highlands? Kalen? The Yangtze. The Yangtze is correct. West, mathematics is your category. Find the sum of the numbers 1 through 20. Stephen? 210. 210, excellent, perfect. Indians, the next category for you is another language question. It happens to deal with initials. The highest position within a major corporation is often referred to as the CEO. What do the initials CEO stand for? Bethany. Corporate Executive Officer. Incorrect. Jaguar's chance to steal this language initials question. The highest position within a major co corporation is often referred to as the CEO. What do the initials CEO stand for? Gib. Chief Executive Officer. Chief Executive Officer is correct. West, you do get the next category, U.S. History. Two th southern cities served as capitals of the Confederacy during the Civil War. Name these two cities. Gib? Richmond and Charleston. Incorrect. Indians, chance to steal this U.S. history category. Two southern cities served as capitals of the Confederacy during the Civil War. Name these two cities. Kalen? Richmond and Atlanta. Incorrect. Richmond is one of them. The other one, Montgomery, Alabama. Montgomery, Alabama. Current events is the next category, which goes to you, Indians. Why did the U.S. suspend non-humanitarian -human aid to Honduras? Kalen? Because of the current conflict over who is their president. That is correct. West, you have the next category, which is a spelling question. The definition means an opening, a hole, mouth, spell, orifice. Stephen. O-R-I-F-I-C-E. That is exactly right. Point on that question. Indians, you have the next category. You, it is world history, world history. Franklin Roosevelt was elected president of the United States in 1932. When was Hitler elected chancellor of Germany? Kalen? 1933. 1933 is correct. 
With that correct response, you have tied the score at four apiece. West, your category is famous quotations in regards to literature. It's a quote from a particular author, and here it is. Man is the only animal that blushes or needs to. Who said it? Walker? Uh, Oscar Wilde. Incorrect. North, chance to steal this famous quotations. Kalen. Mark Twain. It is Mark Twain. North, you do get the next category, which is movies. In which movie was the that won the Best Picture Oscar do we hear the following line? War, war, war. This war talks spoiling all the fun at evening party this spring. I get so bored I could scream. West, chance to steal this movie's category. In which movie that won the Best Picture Oscar do we hear the following line? War, war, war. This war's, war's talks spoiling all the fun at every party this spring. I get so bored I could scream. Kevin? Uh, war and Peace. Incorrect. Gone with the wind. Gone with the wind. West, you do get the next category, which is history. Though the, though the Supreme Court said the, not, uh, excuse me, let me start over. Though the Supreme Court said in the 1830s this tribe was its own nation within Georgia, it didn't work out this way. Name the tribe. Gib. The Cherokee tribe. The Cherokee tribe is correct. North, you get the next category, which is mathematics. Suppose you have a sphere whose radius is 3. You circumscribe a cube around the sphere so that the length of each side of the cube equals the length of the di sphere's diameter. Figure out the volume of the cube. Bethany? 256. Incorrect. Wes, chance to steal this mathematics category. You have a sphere whose radius is, Stephen? 216. 216 is correct. Wes, you do get the next category, which is geography. Its library has so many manuscripts that if they were all unrolled, they would more than cover the entire country. What name is shared by this 108-acre city-state and its library? Walker? Ephesus. Cannot accept that. North, chance to steal this geography category. Its library, Kalen. The Vatican. The Vatican is correct. North, you do get the next category, which is U.S. government. The Senate has 18 permanent committees, while the House has 22. What are such permanent committees called? Time on that. West, chance to steal this U.S. government category. The Senate has 18 permanent committees, while the House has 22. What are such permanent committees called? Gib? Standing committees. Excuse me? Standing committees. Very good. Standing committees. That is correct. Literature is the next category for you, West. Name the author who was also the main character in these books. And here they are. The First Four Years, The Long Winter, These Happy... Peter? Robert Ingalls Wilder. Very good. That is correct. North, you have the next category, which is geography. Lombardy is in Italy. Where is Picardy? West, chance to steal this geography category. Lombardy is in Italy. France. That is correct. France is where Picardy is. Current events is your next category, West. In a recently taped message, who described President Obama as powerless to stop the war in Afghanistan? Kevin. Osama bin Laden. Osama bin Laden is correct. North, you have a, have a category which is art. Donatello's bronze piece dis depicts him unclothed except for a strange-looking hat. He's also carrying a, a severed head. Name the sculpture. West, chance to steal this art category. Donatello's bronze piece depicts him unclothed except for a strange-looking hat. He's also carrying a severed head. Name the sculpture. Peter? David is correct. West, you do get the next category, which is the solar system. 
What did NASA's Dr. Greg Laughlin propose moving into new orbit to solve global warming? Time on that North chance to steal the solar system category. What did NASA's Dr. Greg Laughlin propose moving to a new orbit to solve global warming? Sam? The moon. Cannot accept the moon. We're looking for the Earth. Be quite the undertaking, I would imagine. North, you have the next category, which is Greek. In ancient Greece, the professional itinerant teachers of philosophy, famous for clever arguments, were called what? Time on that. West, you have the chance to steal this Greek category. In ancient Greece, the professional itinerant teachers of philosophy, famous for clever arguments, were also called what? All right, Kevin, I see that you're buzzing. So let's uh, the sophists. The sophists is correct. West, you have the next category, which is geography. The Delaware River separates the Catskills from this Pennsylvania sub-range of the Appalachians. Name it. Kevin? Uh, the Allegheny. That is incorrect. North, chance to steal this geography question. The Delaware River separates the Catskills from this Pennsylvania sub-range of the Appalachians. Name it. <coughs> Looking for the Poconos. Poconos. North, you get the next category, which is mathematics. The sign of what positive acute angle equals the cosine of 55 degrees. <coughs> Time on that. West chance to steal this mathematics category. The sine of what positive acute angle equals the cosine of 55 degrees? <coughs> Stephen? 35. Excuse me? 35 degrees. 35, that is correct. West, you do get the next category, which is authors. Isabel Allende and Pablo Neruda were from Chile. What country were authors Alora Esquivel and Octavio Paz? Peter? Bolivia. Incorrect. North, chance to steal this author's category. Isabel Allende and Pablo Neruda were from Chile. From what country were authors Alora Esquivel and Octavio Paz? Bethany? Venezuela? Incorrect. We're looking for Mexico. Mexico. Indians, you do get the next category, which is music. What Irving Berlin song, written originally in 1917, was revived by Kate Smith and became, for many Americans, a second national anthem? Adam? God Bless America. God Bless America is correct. West, you have the next category, which is language. From the Middle English for spoils, which P word means to steal a small amount or item? Kevin? Pilfer. Pilfer is correct. Indians, next category for you is current events. A September Federal Reserve report on the economy says things are getting better, though what rate is still a worry? Kalen? Unemployment. Unemployment is correct. And with that, uh, Siren, that does bring us to the end of the first half with a score right now of Blue Valley West leading 14 to Shawnee Mission North, 8. This does bring us to halftime of our program, and we are going to a campus representative to tell us what is happening around their, uh, their school. And I believe Blue Valley West, I believe Kevin has been uh, selected for that task. So, Kevin, what is happening with the Jaguars? Well, the new musical Sweeney Todd just started up. We just casted that out. Um, National Merit finalists, or, or sorry, semi-finalists, we have nine of them, and ten commended scholars. It's a school record. Uh, the band is still preparing to go to London for the uh, New Year's Eve parade there, or New Year's Day parade, I should say. Um, and winter sports are starting up, and fall sports are ending. That's all about it. Fantastic. All right. Uh, anybody on your team, member of the band, that's getting to go to London? Uh, I don't think so. Oh, well, that'd be, that'd be quite the trip. Maybe you guys can help out and tag along. <laughs> uh, from Still north, there. we have Bethany. Bethany, what is happening? Uh, give us a campus update for the Indians. 
We also are just now starting winter sports. Um, we have a charity basketball game tomorrow. Um, our ROTC program is doing really well at regionals. We also are starting our winter musical. We're doing Children of Eden, and our winter lab plays are going on. And I think that's about it. <laughs> <laughs> There's a lot to, a lot to be said there. I mean, that's a pretty long list of things to remember, so that's pretty impressive. As we head into the second round, we are doing our look and listen uh, question to start the lightning round. And the look and listen will be uh, given to the contestants via a monitor here in the studio. And one thing also, for those viewing at home, it is worth two points. So, big deal here. All right, here is the look and listen question to start the second round. Name the industrial purification process described here. In the 19th century, a new manufacturing process lowered the cost of steel. Bicycle inventors used steel. All right, we had Gib ring in. Gib? The Bessemer process. It is the Bessemer process. That is correct. For So two points for Blue Valley West. As we head into the remaining part of the second round, it is the lightning round where the questions are placed on the floor for either team to answer. If one team does answer incorrectly, the other team will get a chance to steal the points. All right, both teams, put your hands on your buzzers. Here we go. The category is music. Which patriotic work is the most often performed of Jan Sibelius' compositions? Walker. O Finlandia. That is correct. Both teams, U.S. presidents is the category. This president called an international congress which set the prime meridian international dateline in 24 time zones around the world. Who was it? Who was it who called the Washington, D.C. conference in 1884? Gib? Cleveland. That is incorrect. North chance to steal this U.S. president's category. This president called an international congress which set the prime meridian international dateline in the 24 time zones around the world. Who was it who called that Washington, D.C. conference? Kalen. Uh, Benjamin Harrison. Incorrect. Chester Allen Arthur is who we were looking for. Both teams, geography is the next category. Lake Tahoe is located between California and Nevada. Between what two states is Lake Champlain situated? Gib. New York and Vermont. New York and Vermont is correct. Sports is the next category for both teams. In skiing terminology, this method of checking descent at lower speeds by spreading the ski tails and bringing the points together. It is usually the first maneuver a beginning skier is taught. What is it called? Kalen? The plow stop? The plow stop, is that what you said? Yes. That we will accept that, it's snow plow or plow. Both teams, famous quotations is the category. Who said, the only blind person at Christmas time is he who has not Christmas in his heart? Gib. Dickens. Incorrect. North chance to steal this famous quotations category. Who said, the only blind person at Christmas time is he who has not Christmas in his heart? Time on that. We're going Helen Keller. Helen Keller said that. Literature is the next category for both teams. Name all four of the brawling, lighthearted heroes whose rallying cry is all for one and one for all. <laughs> all right, I don't know. I can't tell if we got one that, all right, that one didn't register. We're going to have to throw that question out. For those playing at home, D'Artagnan, Porthos, Athos, and Aramis were the, the four. U.S. history is the next category for both teams. Sorry about that, everybody. Uh, Gore Vidal referred to what Texas town as the site of the largest massacre of Americans? Kalen. Waco. Waco is correct. With that correct answer, you have brought the score to Shawnee Mission North 10, Blue Valley West 18. The written word is the next category for both teams. The symbol which takes the place of the dropped letter or letters in the contraction as in its and Kalen? Apostrophe. Apostrophe is correct. Mathematics, looking for you to factor a quadratic. Here we go. What are, please factor x squared minus 8 in lowest terms. 
Steven. Okay, X squared minus eight and can't be factored. Sorry, cannot accept that. Kalen? X plus the square root of eight times X minus the square root of eight. I'm sorry, we cannot accept that either. We were looking for X plus two square root of two times X minus two square root of two. Square root of eight. I, but we asked for lowest terms, I'm sorry. Yes. Apologize for that. US government is the next category for both teams. Article one, section eight of the Constitution gives Congress the power to make all lo laws essential to carry out other powers granted to it by the Constitution. It is the elastic clause. Thank you. Good job, Kevin, on that one. Make sure, make sure you remember to call, wait till you're called on, you're okay. U.S. history, again, is the next category for both teams. On this site in July and August in 1585, colonists from England built a fort called the New Fort in Virginia. By 1591, they had all disappeared. Peter. Roanoke. Roanoke is correct. Engineering is the next category for both teams. Engineers have built on the work of T.Y. Lynn, developer of the pre-stressed type of what material? Kalen? Steel. It is not steel. West chance to steal this engineering category. Engineers have built on the work of T.Y. Lynn, developer of the pre-stressed type of which material? Gib. Concrete. Concrete is the answer we're looking for. Science is the next category for both teams. Which law of thermodynamics does the following quotation exemplify? The entropy of any... Kalen? The second law. Cannot accept the second law. West, chance to steal the science category. Which law of thermodynamics does the following quotation exemplify? The entropy of any given system attains the same finite least value for every state of least energy. Peter? The second law of thermodynamics or the law of entropy? Cannot accept that. It says here on the card, third law, third law. World history is the next category for both teams. After AD 312, the Christian religion was adopted as the official faith of the Roman imperial, Sam? The imperial court. Cannot accept that. West, chance to steal this world history category. After AD 312, the Christian religion was, adopt, was adopted as the official faith of the Roman imperial family. The man responsible for this conversion was a Roman emperor himself. Peter. Constantine. Constantine is correct. Language is the next category for both teams. In German, what's the informal you used for friends, family? Stephen? Do. Do is correct. Definitions for both teams. If something is extinct, it no longer is in existence. If something is extant, how would you describe it? Stephen? It's existent. It's existing, that's very good. Animals is the next category for both teams. Although few large animals live on the Scandinavian peninsula, what species of deer, Gib? Reindeer. Reindeer or caribou. That correct answer that does bring the score to Blue Valley West 25, Shawnee Mission North 11. Find the solution set, this is a mathematics category question, find the solution set for the equation x to the third plus 5x squared plus 6x equals zero. Steven. Zero, negative two, and negative three. That is the three that we're looking for. Current events is the next category for both teams. In a bizarre incident, hip hop star Kanye West jumped on the stage and interrupted the, Gib? Taylor Swift. Taylor Swift is who we were looking for there. We run the full gamut here, don't we? Opera is the next category for both teams. What was the nationality of Aida, the title heroine of Verdi's opera? Kalen? Nubian. Nubian, we can accept Nubian or Ethiopian on that. U.S. history is the next category on both, for both teams. At the Constitutional Convention, the New Jersey plan proposed that smaller states have a larger voice in the federal government. What plan advocated, Stephen? The Virginia plan. The Virginia plan advocated that larger states have more power. World history is the next category for both teams. In AD 79, the volcano Vesuvius erupted. 
In a short time, lava and volcanic ash obliterated two. Gib? Pompeii. Cannot accept Pompeii. Bethany. Pompeii and Herculaneum. Pompeii and Herculaneum are the two. Next category for both teams is language in regards to NASA and the law. Which space shuttle has the same name as a pre-trial device to find out what they've got on you? Adam? Discovery. Discovery is correct. Definitions, architecture for both teams. This is the term applied in architecture to the 16th century English building. It's characterized by decorative use of Renaissance styles superimposed on the native perpendicular. What is this style? Stephen? Baroque. That is not Baroque. Indians, chance to steal this architectural definitions category. This is the term applied in architecture to 16th century English building. It is characterized by decorative use of Renaissance styles superimposed on the native perpendicular. What is this style? Lizzie? Gothic? It is not Gothic. It is Tudor. Oh. Tudor. Medicine is the next category for both teams. First described by an English physician in 1717, which disease is marked by tremors of the hands? Kevin. Parkinson's. Parkinson's is correct. Language for both teams. A subtle form of name calling involves using words with negative meaning. For example, critics of a fiscally conservative legislator might call him miserly, while supporters might call him frugal. Both terms have a similar denotation, but different. Kalen? Connotation. Connotation is correct. World history is the next category for both teams. The Seven Years' War saw Prussia and Austria fighting con over control of what region that later became what country? Gib. Uh, Celestia, uh, the Czech Republic. Incorrect. North, chance to steal this world history category. The Seven Years' War saw Prussia and Austria fighting over control of this region that later became what country? Sam? Mm -hmm. Incorrect. We're looking for Germany. Germany on that one. Both teams, current events is your category. What two words did Representative Joe Wilson? Kalen? You lie. You lie is correct. <laughs> With some nice emphasis on that. Good job. Literature is the next category for both teams. Sir Thomas Mallory wrote the greatest book of his century. The century was the 15th. What was the book? Walker? La Mort de Arthur. Very good. That's correct. Language is the next category in regards to finance. The monthly bill from a credit card issuer that summarizes the activity in the account, including outstanding balances, purchases, payments, credits, and financial charges is called a what? Kevin? A receipt? Not a receipt. North chance to get this last question here. Language in regards to finance. The monthly bill from a credit card issuer that summarizes the activity in the amount or in the account, including outstanding balance, purchases, payments, credits, and finance charges is called a what? Kalen? A statement. It is called a statement. That is correct. With that correct answer and that sound of that siren that does end our game here on categories today, with Blue Valley West winning the game 30 to Shawnee Mission North 17. A well-fought battle here on Categories. Please make sure that you join us here again as we bring you the best and brightest minds and academic wit here in the Johnson County area. Thank you for watching.